Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play. Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door, we're gonna do the most annoying mission in the entire game. And you will understand why as we go through it. So, in order to find General White, we need to go all the way back to Paddleburg. You know, back to the beginning of the damn game. Now, thankfully, you know, we have shortcuts. That's fine. That I don't care about. So, like, us going to Pedalburg. Not that hard. Pretty sure I've seen him, too. Like, when, uh, when he was, when he was at Pedalburg. Like, I, I think it was literally at the beginning of the game. We ended up, you know, we go to Pedalburg. We're dealing with coops and whatnot. He was standing outside a house. So, you know, maybe he's there. I don't know. I'm not a psychic. My voice still sounds weird it's because I'm still recovering. So, yeah. See, pretty sure. He was standing here somewhere, I think. No, uh, maybe I need to talk to that uh, Coops' dad. Tell me, Mario, how's my boy Coops doing? Blah, blah, blah. Nope. Are we literally not going to see any? Hey, Mario, you're Luigi's older brother, right? That's so cool. Are we seriously not going to get, like, any information on this guy? Nothing on General White there. Maybe, maybe it was on this screen, then. Yeah, maybe, maybe he was, like, up here. Uh, hmm. Maybe I talked to this guy. Look at those toast, huh? I guess that's a good thing. Seriously? Do I need Bobbery out here? Do I need to talk to the mayor? Huh? What's that? Here we go. General White. Oh, he was here a while ago, but he said he was taking a trip. Then he left. Wait, hang on a second. He did say something about a deserted isle to the south. He was either going there or not going there. Yeah. So now you see what we have to deal with. So... He came here. Oh, look. Turns out he's not here. Now we gotta go to Key Hall Key. Because it's fun. Random searching missions are fun. Alright. We shouldn't really have to do anything except for talk to the people over here, so, like, this one's not too bad. But. Frankie's the whole boss syndicate. Yep. You gotta take him for the XX Express. General White? Yeah, he was here until a couple seconds ago. Then he took off right quick. Said he was going to an arena or something. Yeah, so now we have to go above ground and go to, uh, frickin' Glitzville. Yay! Yay! I freaking love it. And, like, the fact that he went from an island to a floating arena in a couple of seconds is annoying. It's also, I don't think, logistically possible. You know, Rockhawk did send me that email recently. So maybe maybe I just 
beat him in a match again? Like, is it, maybe that's something that we do? Cause he's like, I'll, I'll totally beat you where your mama won't recognize you. So, you know, maybe, maybe we just beat him in a match real quick. Like, just to humiliate him more. Okay, maybe this Toad guy will know about, uh... So the Great... Okay, yep. Great Gonzalez. There wasn't really anybody else outside, though. Oh, well, there's this guy. Gotta admit that Rockhawk guy was overrated. You're the real deal. Well, thank you. I'm awesome. I'm a pretty good storyteller, don't you think? Yeah, I want to be a writer. Sky writer. Heh heh heh. Never make a movie about my life. It would be called The Worry Word of Glitzville. Uh, that's a store. What about the juice bar? Turn white? Oh, you must mean the white bob bomb, huh? Yeah, he used to come in here all the time. But I haven't seen him lately. Now that I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree or not. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. It's great. Since Rockhawk challenged us, let's let's go fight him. Why not? Let, let's go kick his butt. You know, we'll we'll super humiliate him. Reserve the match. No, rank number one. Uh, you want you to use at least one special move. You need to show my paying customers all that fancy ninja stuff you've been hiding. All right. Let's also um, badges. Badge points needed. Get rid of the bump attack. We will grab. Uh, I don't have a power up D down P. Interesting. Well, uh, I, I guess a defense plus P. Why not? Mr. Champion, sir, it's time for your match. Please come this way. Oh, they... Address me as champion. That's nice. <laughs> now for our main event. The former champion, Rockhawk, against the current one, Great Gonzalez. Let me at him. Yeah, bring it. You ready for a beating? You dirty dog. You'll beg me for mercy when I take that belt back. Get ready to brawl. Now, see, it doesn't have the same ring. See, it'd be better if it was get ready to battle. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it right now. <laughs> battle. He's at least one special move. Okay. Um, you know what? We will. We'll do, we'll do this. We'll do. Uh, uh, we'll do uh, power lift. Why not? I don't even think I'm gonna get like any good. Um, uh, uh, any good star points for this either. Alright. This should do a lot of damage. Yeah, that's in 16 damage. That's insane. Okay. And then, um... I mean, yeah, we'll just power smash you. Uh, 
and then ground pound you. And you're gone. I got two star points for it. <laughs> we got ourselves a winner, the great Gonzalez. Here's your fight money. Oh, we got 20 coins. Sweet. Now, if you excuse me, I must be going. Well, there. I defeated him. Maybe we'll get another email. <laughs> like, maybe we'll get another email from Rockhawk or something. Yeah, because they won't let me in, right? Yeah, that's kind of dumb. Like, Rockhawk walked into the major leagues when we were in there. That away, Great Gonzalez. My son never doubted you for a second. Great Gonzalez never loses. I want to be like you. How do I grow a mustache? <laughs> All right. Uh, what do we need to do now? We need to go to a tree. Yes. We need to go to uh, Bogley Woods. That's it. I just ran right past the guy because I wasn't thinking. That was a very quick battle, too. I'm so glad. <laughs> like, that was a two-turn battle. I think at some point we might be able to do a one-turn battle with him. But, uh... That, that would involve, like, a bunch of manipulation of, like, uh... Badges and things like that. Where I would get, like... Eight copies of... I think it's not close call, but a Mega Rush or something like that. Okay, so it went from one to five to three. Now to two. So will it then go to, uh... We'll go to Twilight Town or, um, Poshly next. I don't know who we need to talk to here. Of the great tree. Hey, uh, General White. Yeah, he's an old bob -omb with the great mustache. But I have no idea where he went. He may have said something about going somewhere dark. Alright, Twilight Town. Well, we got stuck there for a second. Okay, so I think we have to go back up in order to be able to land properly as to where we need to go. I don't have the bump attack badge on anymore. Oops. I don't really want to fight you guys, but I mean, I guess I have to. Let's get the uh, bump attack badge back on. I don't want to waste my time with pointless fights. go here. Meow. 
Now I will before before we go to Twilight Town, we're gonna we're gonna go upgrade our last uh, member, or I believe it's the last member. Do that, thank you. Yeah, Flurry's our last member. There we go. Sha Zibby. Sha Zuby. Then you may go. Okay, so she gets up to 40 hit points, which is horrible. 35 due to the uh, HP plus that we have. But I mean, not bad in terms of if you're looking to have one of the bulkier members uh, be like your constant partner. Oh, there's so many, there's so many uh, people to talk to in Twilight Town. I'm going to guess the mayor, but I could be wrong because it wasn't the mayor in Coop Village, so, or Pedalberg or whatever it's called. Maybe it's you. <laughs> hey, you, you must really like this place, huh? No, not really. Well, then you must have come to see me then, right? Gosh, if that's the case, I don't know how to say this, but you're just not my type. Well, how dare you? Uh, you're Mar Yahoo for Mario. It's awesome if somebody said that about you, huh? Yeah, that'd be sweet. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna guess the mayor. Uh, hey, it's the savior of our town. It's Mario. Ever since the pig uh, thing. Okay, it's not the mayor. Huh, General White? Yeah, I know that old guy. He's a white bob -omb, right? He was here until recently. What, where did he go? What am I, a secretary? He looked tired, I know that. Okay. That is the end of our stupid search. We can go back. Once you hear that he's tired, he's at his house in Far Outpost. What? You cannot find General White? There he is. Ah, the mustached gentleman. Where has he gone to? Now, where did he go? This makes trouble for us. We definitely need him. Otherwise, we cannot even operate the thing. So, what to do? So, here we go. He's in here. And immediately, he's fallen asleep. Seems to be asleep. Wake him up. And now we get now we get to do this multiple times. It's so annoying that they make you go back to basically every location just for him to be sleeping in his own damn house. Now, who are you? I am tired. I do not need your attention. I just want to sleep, as it is all hopeless. Uh -huh. Huh? That mustache, that hat, and that hammer even. Hut hut, I have been looking everywhere for you. Why? Well, to bring that cannon back online. 
I had lost my life's work, my very reason to live. I found myself at wit's end, then the roadport fortune teller told me. Seek the man with the red M hat. The one with the hammer and stash, but my hat's not red. My hat's purple. I I'm not the man you seek. You will fulfill your dreams, or something like that. What? You need to use the cannon to help you save the entire world? Hip hip hurrah! The fortune teller was right. So what are we waiting for? I shall get the cannon ready, so go tell the mayor. Now get moving, hot hot! Oh, that brought up a really bad cough. Oh. So, Cannon is back online. Well, I could just explode with delight. <laughs> now, let us shoot you guys to the moon! Yeah, we did it, Gonzalez. Yay! Now, you follow me. He said follow him. You come this way. <laughs> How many games have I played that I've been to the moon? Dark Cloud, this one. I don't think that often. Like the moon's not very a uh, not very much a cliche place it seems. Now you stand here. Okay. Oh, great. Th thanks. General White, is Big Bomb Cannon ready? Huts, leave it to me. Now, men. You know the drill. Load the big bomb cannon. Ho, hup, hut, boom. Now positions everyone. Yes, sir. Bring guidance system online. Bringing system online. System now online. System check. System check. All clear. Prepare for a detonation sequence. It's the same alarm system that they had in the Bogley Woods. Open outer hatch. That is huge. Open inner shutter. Oh, that should have said inner shutters? Elevate on my mark. That is one big cannon. Sighting! Target is the moon! I, I didn't see the moon there. Direction, 7538. Elevation, 4566. Range, 389603. Oh, there it is. Okay. Wind speed, 108. Correct direction, 303. Correct elevation, negative 239. Target locked. Chamber hatch open. Now, everyone in. That is so many bomb bombs. Close chamber hatch. It's crowded in here, boom. Stop pushing, bazoom. Ow, ow, ow. You're on my foot, ba boom. It's tight in here, plume. I'm getting nervous. Stop breathing on my neck. Conditions all green. Stand by. Okay. It is time. Big boom cannon. Fire! I mean, with the way that that trajectory was working, like, we already ended up hitting our, um... I don't, I don't remember what it was called from my physics class, but basically the peak of our height, so we'd only be going downwards. Because, like, we curved up, but then it looked like we flattened. I don't remember what that term is. So it looks like... We, it wouldn't even look like we're making that. <laughs> Wow! 
What 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 is that called? Uh, what is the tip of an arc called? Not the keystone. Nope. Physics. Tip of a curve called. Uh, it's not the slope of the curve. It's not the tangent. I know that. Like, point of tangency, maybe? I don't know. Well, that was awesome. Man, who knew adventurers got to do stuff like that? I'm going to look on the moon as such. Whoa, we're really, truly no fooling on the moon. Let's rock out, Gonzalez. Let's find the last crystal star and save Peach. Even though you're somehow breathing in space. So I, I'd like you to think about that first. Oh god, we're so slow. Do I care about a stopwatch? I don't care about a stopwatch. Oh, what happens if we equip slow go? How slow will we move? Even slower. Jumping is faster. Oh god, there's actual more spaces to go. I kind of want that stopwatch to disappear. So that I don't have to search for it. Good. So I see another little cracked. But there's nothing under there. Okay. Oh my god, we're gonna... We're, this is gonna be so slow, isn't it? Okay, so I think, uh, I think the best idea would be Yoshi. Oh my god, it's so slow. It is so slow. I don't. I don't like how slow this. Like, I get no gra or you know, low gravity in the moon and all that. Blah 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 blah. Do I have the bump attack badge on? Because I should take that off. There are three, four enemies here. That is disgusting. Five enemies here. That's really disgusting. Something over to the right. Something over to the left, so maybe this area here. That's a courage cell. Don't particularly care about it. We'll get rid of that. Let's see if there's anything over on the left here. Well, you know what? We'll actually go all the way over to the left. And maybe that'll help us. Okay, so if we go back to this screen, since we got rid of the Courage Cell, there's still an item to our right. Okay. I think we've fought these guys before, right? I feel like we have. We have. Uh, do I have Quake Hammer? I do. There we go. Okay. So over to the right. Oh, because the Courage Cell respawned. Okay, so we'll toss it away. We'll walk around a little bit. Hopefully it'll disappear. Okay, there's nothing else on this screen. Good to know. Good God, the slowness. Alright, 
we can we can use the craters. It's kind of like a safety point. So I'm gonna guess it's in that uh, in that rock there. So let's do this. Oh, that did like nothing. Okay. Can you not with the, uh... With the fog? Like, the fog's kind of annoying. One star point. Yay! Oh, I will take all the coins. Okay. That's ruin powder. Don't particularly care. So we'll wait for that to disappear. Because then that'll allow me to actually, you know, search for stuff. Nothing else on this screen. Okay. Now, I have a feeling that the only enemies we will end up finding on the main portion here will end up being moon clefts. Oh, does this go around in a circle? What just attacked me? I don't think I have you. Oh, I don't have you. Ooh, okay. Tattle. Z-Yucks. That's a Z-Yucks. It's a genetic improvement of the original Yucks. HP is 7, attack is 4, defense is 0. Multiple mini z will appear to protect the main unit, as you'd expect. Sometimes they also restore HP to the main unit, which really burns me up. Doesn't have much HP, but those barriers often protect it from attacks. Okay. I don't have piercing blow, do I? Nope. Oh, we'll just quake hammer again. Make the uh, make the moon cleft impossible to attack. All right, so now we can get the minis. The mini Z Yux. That's a mini Z Yux. It lives to protect the Z Yux. There can be as many as four. XP is two. Attack is zero. Defense is zero. It doesn't. If you don't clear these guys, you'll never be able to attack the Zeox. Using a multiple strike attack to take them all at once is a really good idea. I mean, I respect them for protecting their whatever, but they get no mercy. Um... Yeah, we'll, just, we'll take care of this guy. Okay, he's only healing himself because he's a moron. There we go, we got rid of the minis. And there we go, we got rid of the z -yucks. Oh, there's a second one. Okay. I mean, this should not be hard at all. Yeah. 
There we go. Easy, easy peasy. I will take the coins. Okay, those coins have gone away. There's another Zux over there. There's an item over to our right. Is it this? I might actually use that power-up punch. I don't particularly care about the dizzy dial. You just gotta wait. Gotta wait for it to disappear. Probably takes longer to disappear because it's on the moon. For whatever reason. Okay, there's an item over to the left still. Might be it might be in this uh, little rock formation here. Oh, I don't. Nope, it's not there. Um. Okay, where is it? Over to the right. Over to the right. So we probably have to fight this guy. Yeah, I didn't think so. But, um, we're gonna swap around. Go to Goombella. I failed. Yeah, that's fine. That was the wrong move. That's okay. So many rocks. So we'll do this, get rid of you. And we'll get rid of you. So now we will Quake Hammer. Okay. So we'll see if there's like a star piece in this area here. Back to our left. Back to our left. Okay, it's kind of in this formation here. Let's do a quick equip of the uh, bump attack badge. There. Okay, star piece. I don't want to get the outside of the moon done first before we go into the uh, actual base. Okay. No item here. We'll go one more. We'll go one more screen over because then that will kind of give me an idea if we like went around the entire uh, thing because it could have just been a uh, you know a loop that you end up doing yeah there's so many enemies here Jesus nope uh, I guess we still have screens to do Don't care about a Volt Shroom. 
All right, so when we come back, we're gonna uh, we're gonna continue going around until I don't see uh, any more items for us to collect. And when we come back, uh, exploring the moon. Thanks for watching.